All right, so here we are, guys. We're going to talk about today the top 10 snacks purchased from Amazon Pantry in 2019. Uh, number 10 was the Pepperidge Farm Goldfish Crackers Cheddar Flavor. Number 9 was the Nature Valley Granola Bars Crunchy Oats and Honey. Number 8 was the Frito-Lay Classic Mixed Variety Pack, so that includes Lay's Potato Chips, Doritos, both Nacho Cheesier and Cooler Ranch, regular Cheetos, Sun Chips, and Fritos. Number seven is the Double Stuff Oreos. Number six is the Rice Krispie Treat Bars. Number five is the Cheez-Its Original Baked. Number four, Mott's Unsweetened Applesauce. Number three, the Quaker Chewy Granola Bars Variety Pack. So it has s'mores, peanut butter, and also dark chocolate chunk. Number two is the Ritz Peanut Butter Cracker Sandwiches. And number one is the Smart Food for, uh, Popcorn Variety Pack. Guys, we need to revise this list, and we need to revise yeah. it quickly. That is a terrible, list. That's just such a list. bad list. Terrible oh, list. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, so, guys, number one, we're just going to not... We're not going to... So, what we have here, guys, on our tier list is we have five different items here. Best of the best. And then we have... That is pretty good. And then we have... Eh, take it or leave it. Followed by No Thank You. And then at the bottom, it is throw that away. So, guys, I'm going to go ahead and start with, let's go with the Mott's Unsweetened Applesauce. Uh, Nathan, go mm. ahead. Where, where's, your, where's your thoughts on this one? See, I might be a little higher mm -hmm. on this than you just because I'm a huge applesauce fan, but I will say the type of applesauce here is, it's not the best. It's not. No, I, go I'm, cinnamon or something. I'm team right? applesauce. Yeah, okay, okay. But I'm team cinnamon or team go-go squeeze. There is a way more proficient way to ingest my applesauce. I don't even know what go-go squeeze go -go is. Go-go squeeze is made for kids, and it's like in a go-gurt patch, but not, but just full of applesauce. Like, I used to buy it for, like, my nephews, and then I ate them. Did you guys know that go -gurt is just yogurt? But it's in a package, so <laughs> it's easier to transport. You don't need a spoon. All right, so anyway, <laughs> that's where the applesauce is. So it's unsweetened, which is dumb. Right. I mean, I've got mine fairly low on my list. Okay. Um, so personal opinion, I like the applesauce. I'm leaning towards either that is pretty good or the take it or leave it. So I need your guys to kind of break my... I'd probably throw it at take it or leave it. We'll put it there for now, right in the middle. Okay. Yeah. That's a good base. That's it a is. good baseline, I think. Number one, guys, it's a moderately healthy snack, so right. good for and, you, and I, I have, Again, I have nothing against applesauce. I've never craved choosing the wrong flavor of applesauce. Sure. sure. Right, right. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, let's go on now to Goldfish Crackers Cheddar. Uh, Charlie, take it away. See, I, in my opinion, I've got goldfish crackers low on my list. I, I think goldfish crackers are the lesser of the two cheese cracker on this list. Cheez-Its are by far the better cracker. I agree. So I, 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 would, so I have it lower on yeah. my list. I would agree, too. Um, I'm not a big cheddar baked snack fan of many mm -hmm. of those, but I feel like the goldfish was just designed for a child. Uh, and, and again... 100%. And okay. again, for goldfish, I think you're choosing the wrong flavor going for cheddar. The pretzel ones? Mm -hmm. So oh, phenomenal. Pizza. Yeah. Pizza. Pizza. Pizza great. goldfish. Great. Yeah. Pizzas are okay, but the pretzels. The, the pretzel yeah. ones? No, yeah. No, I'm not mad. I'm okay. not mad. Yeah. So, uh, so where are we thinking here, guys? I think a no thank you. No thank one. you for no, no thank you. It's definitely lower than the applesauce for yes, me. Yes, yes. I'd agree. Ah, love it. Love it. Uh, so next, guys, we are going to go with the Lay's Variety Pack. Um, I'm going to lead up the conversation here. This is my second favorite item mm -hmm. in the list. Um, you get Doritos, two varieties, yes. delicious. Yes. The worst thing on yes. here is a sun chip, and I like sun yes. chips. Yes, preach. Yeah, I, I, am, I am all, and you, Say it oh my gosh, if you could take your lunch to school, one day you have Doritos, and next day you have yes. Cool Ranch, and next day you have Cheetos, Cheetos. Cheetos is the greatest small bag of the it, bunch because there's so much in there compared to the others. Right. Absolutely, less right. air. Oh, less air. And they're smaller, you can fit so much in, you crunch it up, make it a nice topping for your pizza, I'm going too far. Let's no, go. the bags themselves are great size too, no. so you, you don't have to eat like a whole bag of chips. Yeah. Or no, if you do want to eat a lot, you can have some nacho cheese Doritos no. and then switch right over to the lasers. Absolutely. Something. I think that's what makes this such a great one and puts it a little this, higher on the list because of a variety. This is the top the, of the list. This is the best this of the is, best. This currently. is not the best Cur of the best for me, but, but, but currently, it's definitely up on the list. We'll talk later. We can always move these down. Yeah. For right now, we're, we know we're working, but I am with you. It's it's a phenomenal snack right now. So, Parents of America, I'm not mad at Can't you at that beat. one. I'm not mad at you at that one. That should have been number one. 
<laughs> All right. Uh, so next we're going to go with the Nature Valley Crunchy Oats and Honey Bar. Awful. Boo. Zero. And last on the list. Boo. The Boo. worst one on this list. We're not going to talk any farther except your bars get stuck in my teeth so bad. <laughs> or they're all over the floor. Absolutely. Like It's either in your teeth or on the floor. There's Fix <laughs> it. You are the now and later of oat bars. Okay? <laughs> fix it. <laughs> Black licorice of oh, old bars. Gosh. Oh, abs- oh my gosh. You're the, oh, just the worst. Well, then let's get into like Charlie's favorite because he says these are garbage. Because the, it's the texture. It's the texture of these. It has a better the texture. flavors it is, aren't. It does. If, if they, the flavors are not necessarily not there. Honey, oats, good flavors. If they were there in a different way, I think this yeah. bar would be better. Sure. So, but well, because of the fact that when you take one bite, half the bar falls on the ground because it's crumbly, that's what makes it a terrible yeah. snack. So, what we're going to now is actually the variety pack chewy granola bar that Charlie is madly in love with, and uh, you can't see our seats right now, but me and Nathan's chairs are side by side in a united front against Charlie. Yeah, <laughs> you can't see it. But it happened. You know, I just rolled over so slightly. But Charlie, go ahead. Make your point. It's like the scene in Les Miserables. <laughs> <laughs> Barricade between us. My, my, my argument for the Chewy Granola Bars, not only same argument as with the Lay's variety pack. It is a variety pack, so you do get more options. I, I okay, that way. And I, I, any of the variety packs where you're getting multiple options, I'm going to throw those a little higher, except for the popcorn. Um, but... For me, the reason that Chewy is such a high spot on my list, number one, in fact, is more of a nostalgia thing. I ate them as a kid. I ate them growing up, and I had them as a snack. I would literally, I would, and my mother will be listening to this, I literally stole them from the pantry and took them upstairs and just ate them in my bed when I was a kid. (laughs) That's weird. It's a, it's a, I mean, because there's chocolate. I mean, they were like a, they were like a sweet treat. They are a sweet treat. They there's, are, a, there's yeah. a s'mores one. I mean, they're, they're, they, sh- they kind of market themselves as a moderately healthy snack. They're not. They are not. They are not. They are not at all. Nope. But those I would, are liars. They, they are those Quaker oats guys. We gotta and, get them. And the reason mine's that high on the list is more of a, is a lot of a nostalgia. So Quaker oats hashtag not a sponsor. But if you want to be a sponsor, we'll change this list. <laughs> yes. Just letting you know. We'll shoot you straight <laughs> just, to the top. Just letting you know you will be the best of the best. But till then, <laughs> our, I'll, I'll concede. To go into it's pretty good because you guys don't like. <laughs> oh that my god! I was <laughs> thinking no, thank you. <laughs> no, I was thinking I get the very. You know bottom. what? I'll, I'll middle you guys. We take it or leave it. Oh, I'll middle god. you guys right now, and we'll move <laughs> on. All right. Um, Applesauce is better than that. No, <laughs> they're all the same, right? There. That's the same list there. Uh, so we're gonna go to my favorite snack on the list: uh, the double stuff Oreo. It's my number two. Um, Go That's ahead. at the bottom of the list for me. I don't understand that. An Oreo is the greatest cookie ever it is. made. A regular Oreo. Too much fill in here. <gasps> Too much no, no, no. Filling. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Okay. So what you do with the double stuff, and this is why they made it. I'm pretty sure they got my email back when it was made in the 90s. Mm-hmm. Um, so what you do with this double stuff Oreo, you can't do it with the regular one, is you take the prongs of your fork and you stick it in between the two sandwich you dip it in your milk. And then you have a nice placement for your milk. Yeah. And then also it's mm-hmm. hands-free. And then mm-hmm. when, you know, it's just sitting there soaking, you're watching TV, you're enjoying your time, you're watching a goofy movie, and then all of a sudden when you're Great ready, movie. you just pop it on out on the fork, slide another one on. I'll concede. Yes! So <laughs> so I have a question It's now. definitely going to throw either best of the best or that's pretty good. I there's, it at that's pretty good. Because there's, pretty there's, there's a, I mean, there's only five spots here, but there's we, ten snacks. We, so can, we can put as much on any right. one that we want. That's what I'm saying. Um, so, Charlie, I'm leaving this to you because clearly, to me, it's the best of the best. He is a that's pretty good. So and that's being generous to you guys, too. Yes, and this is you're the deciding vote on this one. I, I will definitely throw it that best of the best because it's number two on my list. Okay. Okay. Uh, then we're going to go to the one that we're going to all just bitch about 100%. Let's go with this popcorn variety Ugh. pack. Oh, my gosh. Nathan, just awful. take the hate. Go I ahead, am Nathan. surprised that this even made it on the list, let alone is the number one purchased snack food in America on Amazon last year. That blows my mind. Okay, so I'm going to say this as um, people who know more parents now. I found that popcorn tends to be like – one of the number one snacks that they give their like toddlers to hold the small bag, easy to eat. So I just imagine every suburban mom out there bought this off Amazon. So shame on them. Get their kids better snacks. Mm-hmm. Pirate booty is a better popcorn if you're going to go that route. Mm-hmm. Um, but 
Yeah, and making this number one. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. I like popcorn. Yeah. But come on. Yeah. I, I definitely, it, on my list, I think I had this second to last, just above the Nature Valley. I think I had it in the middle somewhere just because I like popcorn, yeah, but I'm it's not. Yeah, I'm looking at a th- throw that away or no thank you. Yeah, I mean, mine, I, I was never a huge popcorn fan because, I mean, I, I don't know about you guys, but I had braces. Yeah. I mean, I had braces, yeah, yeah, yeah. but rules same, didn't apply same, to me. Right. <laughs> same thing with, like, gum and, and and those things that you can't have with braces. You, I had braces for a long time because I was terrible at it. And mm-hmm. I, yeah. I ate the things that I wasn't supposed to, but you are train you train yourself not to eat those things. So in my head, popcorn is one of those things where I'm like, I still can I don't eat a lot of popcorn. Can we go no thank you because popcorn's good, just not this popcorn? Just to give pop, just to give or, for or, but yeah, that's fair. Okay. Is, that, is that fair? I, for, I, now. I'll, for now. I'll concede to no thank you. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Um, next we're going to go with the better cheese snack. Let's talk about Cheez-Its. Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, this is the original, so it's not those different it's, varieties. It's not white cheddar. It's not, it's not white cheddar. Uh-huh. It's not uh, extra toasty. Uh-huh. I love me some extra toasty. Our, our Facebook, a lot of people loved the Tabasco and the Duos. I love the Duos. Oh, yeah. I love if I can get a bite of regular and the, the bacon. Mm. Oh, there's a bacon one? Yeah, no, I haven't had the bacon oh, one. It's so good. It's Very so good. good. You yeah. che- Nabisco, you did well with cheese. Oh, absolutely. You did well. Yeah. So, again, hashtag no Keep- sponsor, but you can be a sponsor at any time. <laughs> we, you know, we've already talked great things about cheese. We have. Oh, Nabisco. Oh, Nabisco. <laughs> Actually, we can change our stance real quickly if they don't sponsor us. Absolutely. Absolutely. You guys are going down. Um, <laughs> so, personal opinion, I do love Cheez-Its. It's not my favorite, but I have them at, that is pretty good. Yeah, I'd I put had them at the best of the best. But. See, I had them in number four on my list just because I had other things that were higher. Okay. Um, okay. So, so I would good. I would say that's pretty good. Okay. Okay. I'm I'm not mad. I like it. I like it. Um, and then we're gonna go with the peanut butter sandwich Ritz cookie or crackers. Sorry. Um, I am vetoing anything I have to say. I don't like peanut butter. Never have. Never will. So I have no that, say in this. That's odd to me. It. I've tried many times different varieties. I've tried. I've even tried almond butter. Like maybe it was just so I'm out. Cashew so I'm gonna let you guys take it away on this one. Mine's pretty middle of the list. I would say I'm, mine's if if I had to pick one right here right now, I'd say that's pretty good. But that's just because I really see. Enjoy I'd go them, I'd go farther down. I I'd go either. I'd probably go take it or leave it. Um, just because I mean that's another one where it's like just like Rob. Some people just don't like peanut butter. Yeah. So if yeah, Rob, your your opinion is not excluded. You don't like peanut butter, so we'll bump it down on the list a little bit. Then I'll go take it or leave it, just there to agree with Charlie, but also have you there. And I'll put it in between. I'll put you know I'll put it behind the granola bars. Peanut butter snacks for me a lot of the times are are ones that I I don't like things getting stuck on the roof of my mouth. Oh yeah. So like when you take a bite of it and the peanut butter and that cracker just mix and they just stick to the roof of your mouth and you're like getting it trying to get it all day. Mm-hmm. All day. Wow. It's a, it's a hyperbole. <laughs> it called into work. I just, yeah, I could, you know, <laughs> you know, Larry, I just, I can't come in today. I got some peanut butter stuck to the roof of my mouth. Just, I, can't, I, I, I just can't do day. it. I have to take a day. <laughs> uh, so last but not least, we have the Rice Krispie Treats. Um, so my mom make these, makes these like five times a year and I love them. Um, this is... Those are probably 10, those are probably homemade, 20, yeah, hundred times better. They are because than, than this because my mom's like, you know what, this needs more sugar, more <laughs> yeah. butter, more everything terrible for you. That's wonderful. Rice Krispies to me again I'll go with a little nostalgia, like if high school or like elementary school sports, like when you're when you're doing those little league and whatnot, and they every every week somebody gets to bring snacks, and it's like it's always a Capri Sun and a friggin. Uh, Rice Krispie Street. Oh yeah. So I, again, that goes to a nostalgia thing for me. I mean, they're they're good. They're nothing. I would say nothing to write home about. Uh, obviously, homemade ones are better, but they're they're average to me. Nathan, I'd put them at no thank you. No thank you. Uh, I think I would. As well. I like them, but I don't think I've ever purchased a Rice Krispie treat mm. ever. The last time I probably I, ate one was like at a little league soccer game when like, the moms gave them out. Yeah, afterwards. yeah. Like I, I eat them when someone yeah. makes them, but I don't think I've ever like been like I want a rice krispie treat. Yeah. So I, what are you saying here? Throw it away? I'm not gonna throw it away, but I I think I agree with the no thank you. For the purposes of the list, I will go no thank you. Will you I'm, I, gonna, I, I'm gonna put I, it I above goldfish. I'm gonna put it up like the first on the no thank you. Like it just didn't make take it or leave it. Okay. I 
Are you okay? Are you gonna be yeah, okay? No, I'm. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm just. In, I'm thinking in my head where the other things are. I'm looking at my list and and uh, kind of seeing where seeing where everything stands. Things get fiddled. Yeah, they do. They do. <laughs> Thank you guys very much for watching. This was a segment from the podcast, Three Guys Walking to a Bar. You can find us on both iTunes and Spotify. But while you're here, you might as well subscribe. We're going to be posting videos every few days, including cocktail recipes, tier lists, and a few other bonus videos. Links are in the description for everything I just mentioned. I hope you enjoyed. And bars closed. <laughs>